Okay, hey guys, what's up? Yo, Emilio, what's up, my man? I'm gonna share it around a bit. And I'll be right with you. I did the video you asked uh, for Thursday, I mean you. I'll do the video you asked for Thursday. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, Christmas time and mistletoe and wine. Children singing. Motion. Okay. Uh, how's everyone doing? Al-Lurahi. Seems the interest is uh, not as much as yesterday. Kind of worried for the game if there's not so many people interested. Right off the bat. Uh, or maybe most of my followers are interested in... Um, in uh, Rome. Which could be too. So, guys, today, if you haven't seen the video, just posted it. We're going to continue from where the video left. Uh, we're going to replay uh, Sparta, Menelaus, uh, over here. I've taken the city of Trinius. I'm very close to my close to my scene. But we're not going to be playing the campaign. We're going to be trying to cheese. Uh, I'm going to try and come down here and capture um, Crete. That's going to be my aim. But what's the cheese I'm going to be only aiming for? So this says it can give me minus 10% recruitment cost of foreign units in the present within Menelaus rosters, own armies in this province. So if you get all four of these, theoretically speaking, theoretically speaking, it could break the, the, the game. You think so, Emilio? You genuinely think so? Because it's such a lovely style as well. So he has no movement speed left. Uh, that we can see now, no movement speed left. His army is decent enough shape, and we have a problem because bronze is going to be an issue. So let's go trade. Uh, we have food. So, yeah, this guy doesn't like food. The same. Bingo, bango. All right. Hello, Achilles, my man. What up? barter agreement so you get wait let's say you got 10 and I get 50 55 60 65 70 ooh 80 okay 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 if I give you one more what if you give me no Yeah, I can do this for six turns. Good. Uh, add military. Oh! 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 Maybe. 
Oh, one second, guys. I'll read your messages. Oh, yeah, this works. I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna get all of this guy's stuff. I don't really like the new Total Wars after Three Kingdoms. Why not? They're really nice. I think that most people wanted a historical, not fantasy. This is a historical. It's a history we don't understand, but it's still historical. Um, we still need foods. Yeah. 200. So 200 is not a thing. So let's just remove that and keep going up. Okay. 220. Okay. Uh, exit negotiations. It's still a historical title in the sense that, you know, it's based in history. That's what it is at the end of the day, right? 120. Oh, sorry. I was just checking the sound. Yeah, we're doing good. Um, just, uh, just all new graphics and stuff. Yeah, but, dude, guys, things need to evolve. It's not a 50-50, Emilio, at least from not from what I was playing. Like, from what I showed you guys, there isn't, like, the myths. They kind of tried to market it like that, but, you know, people, uh, you know, you cannot make people happy. Some people are complaining because it's too, too hard. The same people are complaining because it's too easy or whatever. Uh, just like the old style. Yeah, but the old style didn't really work for them, did it? Uh, T, uh, when Rome 2 came out, it was an absolute disgrace of a game. Now it's great, but that, that took years. Uh, I think I'm just going to end the turn here. And I'm actually going to go in the stream in, in case Scrappy Boy, Greasy Boy, or any of the the big boys want to join in. So my scene is ridiculously strong because they have really good recruitment early on. They're doing good. Guys, don't forget to leave a like on the video. It helps a lot. A lot of people still hate Rumpel. That is true. Exactly. Ugh, people are fickle. I mean, there are 10,000 people who play wrong too, on average, uh, per month, so. Maybe another 20,000 interested, so that's your entire... People do play 12-12, but it is such a niche... Um, such a niche concept of a game that... I mean, it's a mod of a game, right? Uh, maybe a couple of thousand, 2,000, 3,000. What did say? More like a few hundreds. 12, 12. It's very, very niche. And, like, and even if you play, like I would be considered one of those because I've logged in a few times the past month because I was making videos about it, but it wasn't... Yeah, it's... I mean, yeah. Single bar. I think people just need a, con a reason to hate on something. Uh, he's going to give us bronze, military alliance, Nestor. Um, kind of wanted your territory, but yeah, this works. That works for me. House of Gods. Okay, we built uh, Zeus, we got f woods, uh, we recruit one agent. Um... Can we recruit? We can recruit a priestess. So, may, I've already made the barter. So she's Apollo, Poseidon, Poseidon, Athena. Athena's not bad. Um, let's let's get her. Uh, right, c come. On. You'll carry that out. You are building up sanctuary of Zeus. How are we as happiness? We are going up and. Good. Um, we are struggling with stone, so I'm gonna build this up first. And um, I was going to build this, but it doesn't look like it's worth building it here. But that is local recruitment capacity, and hmm, it might be worth it. But I need wood, so I'll build that. And Menelaus. This place is not going to rebel anytime soon, but after I leave, it's going to be in a bit of a problem. It was very, very confused. Yeah. 
a lot of people were confused when they played that the first time. Although I loved how it looked, it just doesn't work. Atta and Rome need a little bit extra love, more than normal. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go down here, and we're gonna enter. Ask me any questions you guys want, by the way, I'll try to answer them with regards to the game. Some kind of cheap version when you have to... It's a lot harder. It's not per se harder. Okay, he wants single water. Decline. I'm gonna kill him eventually. Demeus. Uh, failure. Oh yeah, I forgot I have this settlement over on this side. That's not good. Uh, early harvest. Blighted crops. Harvest third. What does this do? Uh, four turns. And this is six turns. Uh, faction wide. Um, recruited hero and had to come ritual. Okay. Uh, what is this? Oh god, this guy's. Oh boy, this is not gonna go well. Alright, recruit hero. Um, yeah, this is not going to be easy. 17 army. Um, well, we'll see how it goes. Uh, we need a defender. Uh, yeah. You, it will take you a while to recruit those bad boys. So, um, wait. And let's say we recruit those three, and we got you three of these Lycosian uh, swordsmen. Imperator, so is it hard? Is it so hard to understand? Imperator, Rome. Um, never played it, but yes, I have good authority that it is hard to understand. I have to come down this way. We'll take Kisamos, and we'll just come up the coast. It's okay to lose one settlement for another. Absolutely fine. We're doing good with most of our resources. We're of course having issues with regards to wood, but we'll get there soon. Uh, Chintria is... What the hell is this? It's down here. We'll be okay. I would have no clue what to do with all the dealings and stuff, but it explains it to you completely, T. Like, it, once you start the game, it just, you, there's a, some text to read, yes, but it will explain to you, you know, various different areas, why you need to do certain things, etc. So let's say we are struggling with food right now, so let's build this up. This is going to be a really expensive army, but if we get time to recruit it, we are going to be in a really good position because we'll be able to beat this off. And even just this base over here, it will be difficult for them to properly take it off from us. Um, this army is a bit trash, but we should be able to take down the settlements. So I think we're okay. Divine will, how are we? With? We have the Cult of Zeus, so our club infantry will do okay. Uh, we're going to end turn here. First time I played Rome, I was building a uh, base in Jakarta. If I like the car, I built it. There you go. There you go. Uh, oof. Mm, no. So this guy wants a hundred sixty. No. Some of these characters are weird as hell. Nah, dang it, they attacked. Uh, I'm gonna try and fight this, but I lost the settlement. Um, I thought I'd be able to recruit that army, but definitely lost the settlement. So fight battle. Oh wait, what?
my settlement is over here. Dang it, I can't go in there. I like this when like you're fighting a battle close to a city, you actually can see the city. Uh, but I'm gonna retreat, man. The gods smile. Reinforcements are here. Retreat, 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 retreat. Retreat and battle. Oh, uh, you have a battle soon. Um, in the next few turns, it's just I need to get this army in a good position where I can I can win the fight. Did I fuck? Oh, I fucked up the settings again for the stream. You guys are slightly behind. Um. Dang it. Definitely saved the fight, but there's no way I can win this. Oh boy. That that didn't go well. And he can take the settlement now. Yep. Dang nabbit. Alright. Uh, go away. Okay. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So, diplomacy. We're going to... Wait. Don't I have allies? Okay. Uh, apparently it's not telling me. It's not letting me. You come all the way down there. We should be able to come to Kisamos next turn. Um, and we shall upgrade. We need stone for that. And this gives us stone. The stone is in short supply. It's a pain in the ass that he has that army, but that's a really weak army which I could stop if he attacks Sparta. Uh, I won't be. I'll be able to do some damage via attacks at this with that, but we'll see. I take. I should be able to take Kisamos really easy with what I have. Jesus Christ, Agamemnon. He's sending the entire bloody fleet. Shouldn't you be saying the other way, sir? With your, uh, with your great army? Definitely getting close. They made the game a fantasy type of it could have been received better. Yep, probably I mean yeah. I think it's just people misunderstanding exactly what they wanted um what was given. By the way, is it lagging, guys? You should tell um, me in a few seconds. Uh shouldn't have an army here. No, he doesn't. Hopefully we will take Kisamos ourselves. 
are there, there there's no historical battle in Troy because there are no known there's no history of Troy people haven't like there isn't a written history of what happened in Troy I'm just like oh my shit it's really worth getting unless you get here to upgrade any voyage to Italy they could yeah I mean if you look at the map okay this can easily grow this way Balkans Italy so it's definitely definitely uh, an expandable map will be all based on how how popular the game will be at least that's my personal opinion oh we can build a spy spies uh, next turn hopefully be a take to Kisamos I mean he should struggle to take Kisamos but then again he has really good units uh, Kevin Mon is really strong uh, this should stop soon although it's draining my money but we got a lot of stockpile of bronze so that's good for us uh, and I'm, I'm pissed that I lost the settlement but we'll take it back We'll take it back. Jesus. Straight for it, huh? Uh, sure. Mm, no. So he took the field. Yeah, that's right. Wood is more important right now. Nice, we got the gold, so we kind of are in a good place with that. Uh, let's fight this. So, start deployment. Just by the way, look at how gorgeous the map is, though. So, this seems to be a tier 2. Yeah, alright. We'll attack from there. So, uh, Light Spears will hide them there. This will be our militia to charge in. We have some renowned slingers. That will be our front line. So, we should have done anything. Arconians charge in with the militia. And the Spears will be put protecting the slingers um, you guys are there and you're just in the rear for any good fun now something I would like to note is the speed on these light runners 66 they're ridiculously fast and good fun to use uh, we'll get them here he's not gonna come out soon it's coming out in two days, yeah. How are sieges of cities with walls? Hopefully I get to show you one today. They're quite hard, um, but ridiculously fun. I'm doing a video on just the walled settlements and just exploring various walled settlements that Troy offers. That will come sometime in this weekend. The foe has sighted your hidden units. We should be able to take down that really quickly. You go there. You come quickly, draw the fire. And spears front and center, please. You come over on this side. Uh, wait, you three, I need you here. Melanaeus, go front, she charge with that. You get ready to charge into those flanks. And you boys uh, shoot at that militia. This militia over here is not gonna have a good time. These light spears are so much fun. Look at them, poke. Like, look at their shields as well, they're so nice, well, well made. 
So the spear's coming in from the rear. Okay, uh, you guys come here. Uh, Melanaeus, you... Wait, what does this do? Forces the target to attack. And he's gonna really deal damage to that. Can you go there? Um, I need you to come in there. You go in. Ah, slingers, I need fire at will, no, fire at will, no scare mission, guard mode. Go over there, charge in, charge in the rear of this, and you charge there. Dave, Vanir needs to evolve, they are happy about it too. We used to do a video running and running in the 90s background, I'd love to. Even the graphics look... No, it doesn't look like the graphics from the mobile game, dude. The main problem with the graphics is because my PC doesn't handle it. Otherwise, it's... Okay, you deal with that, you deal with that, and you deal with that. Because my PC is a little bit uh, ancient. Shoot at that. Uh, okay, one of you come block that. Let's uh, charge over here. These guys are breaking. Cool. Okay, you go there, get in there. Ah, okay, he's running. And these light spears are so useful. 142 kills is ridiculous. And they took how many losses? Uh, they took like six losses, maybe. The other way. Kill that. This should be our game. I don't know what else is. Oh, it is. And button. Thing I don't like is the fact there are only three different types of face models. What do you mean by that, Emilio? Oh, stabby stabby and. Big stabby. It's good food, some gold, good experience. We didn't take that much damage overall. Um, I will... Uh, I wish I could suck it, but that he'll take it. I will just occupy the settlement, actually. I don't like it, it's the chicken. There's, there's a spear archer. That is a really minor thing, though. Hopefully he doesn't take up. He doesn't siege up Terra because I want to show you that. I think he means the unit icons. Ambassador of Hermes, Fetic reduction. Fetic reduction is insane. I'm sorry about the delay. I messed that, messed that up. So this is the stone. The stone ones back here. This one doesn't need anything. No, this is the. Yeah, this is the stone one, so the stone one will... We need more growth, so I'm gonna put... Minus one to happiness, that's alright. It gives us a little, little bit extra love, and we'll get the extra food. Um, this settlement is okay. We have the apprentice Fletcher, we'll destroy that. And get a proper building. <laughs> Everyone is obsessed with Tron too. Um... Okay, so that was our fight. We did get this, so we'll go... This is good, this is what I was aiming for, and we'll unturn. You prefer Rome 2 because that's what you're essentially used to right now, but once you get used to it, you'll see it as nice as well. Attila and Rome use the same engine. This is a very different engine. This is based on the Warhammer engine, which I really, really, really ridiculously like. To practice and feel better, just leave the stream on to for views. Thank you so much, team. Have fun, buddy.
Hey Lucas, what's up, man? I just keep uh, just to remind everyone. There's a little bit of a delay on the stream. Made a mistake but on the settings, but should be alright. Single block in the. Though we have nine thousand food. Hey Reese. Hi. How are you guys? Uh, trade. They want. Nope. We don't have the stone. The Shining City. Uh, an elite unit is available in the pool. Upgrade a building to maximum. Oh, we have an elite unit. So there is this function where you can special recruitment and there are elite units. In this case, it's a light runner, something I really like. Because these guys are so good, except we need 70 gold for it. God damn it. He's going to take it before we get there. Jesus Christ. So, we'll be able to recruit it. Uh, we could recruit it this turn. Let's see. Let's see if someone that hates gold and loves. This guy wants gold. This guy wants gold. This guy hates gold. Lovely. He wants to own. Alright, let's trade with him. Uh, he hates us, though. Um, Alright, uh, single barter. Barter is the new trading system, just so everyone understands. Um, no, wait. I'll offer this. Wait, 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 wait. I'll offer this. Let's say 200, and I request 60. 300. Okay, we're close enough. I'll give you 200 of this. Yeah, single barter, it works. Uh, okay, and that means Melanaeus over here gets to recruit this, which is an instant recruitment, and will be great, because those two running together is going to be our hit squad. We will go in here, and we'll go in number stance. It's the fact that the units are in this kind of for as, as in ancient times. Absolutely, but I wish needs. To. We have. To. Oh, that's really good. Actually, you can't ambush. So this is really interesting. You cannot be in ambush stance if there is another army, even if they're your allies close by. So this is really cool. This is the settlement I really want. Lapa since it has gold mine, but having Ateria is really useful as well for us. Uh, we'll build that so we have a decent amount of food and wood income. Uh, wood over here will upgrade as well. And once we have the wood rolling, we'll be able to do decent trades. Now we need to find a way to get bronze, which I'm assuming there is a bronze. Yeah, there is Festus. So we'll have to defeat Nostos uh, to take the bronze from him. Or we could. Okay, he is sieging. Join war against who are these guys? Uh, Itachi, nope. I am not joining war against Odysseus. Single barter, uh, barter agreements, nope. Poseidon for uh famously the spice destroying uh you know, stone which according to Hajin forced to build by Zeus. Oof. He's back close. Um so he's sieging there, he'll probably take it out. Um he actually might get beaten. No no that's not so Oh we're gonna go take this. Which seems to have been raided. Um Lapo. Yeah, it's been laded. Uh, I will fight the battle manually though to make sure I don't get any losses whatsoever because that will be a painful, painful thing. Start deployment. 
Okay, uh, let's just be a little bit fancy. Okay, a game of Thrones Total War. They cannot do so, man. Uh, the main reason why they can't do so is because it would cost so much to get the rights that it's not worth it. That's the same reason with Lord of the Rings. That's why they, we don't have a Lord of the Rings Total War. And formation. You guys go forward. You guys change and run that way. And you guys change and come here. You stop there. We'll catch you in our little trap. You run. You charge in. You charge into there. You charge into there. Oh my god, these guys did so much damage just running into their background. And battle. And Narnia one. To have the mod. Yeah, the mod is done by people outside of the company. We only had one loss there. How is that a decisive victory? It was a that was a heroic victory. Uh, occupy. Okay. Um we have this. Ooh, high influence in the region. Okay, hopefully they lose the fight here, but I highly doubt it. Uh, we've taken two settlements. Two less than I hoped for. But we shall see. Meanwhile, let's build... This is minus three happiness. This is minus three. This gives us a little bit of extra happiness in this region. And this gives us a little extra as well. as will favor Zeus. Zeus, the old boy. Uh, you, you're gonna come up all the way up there. That's just up there. Okay, you're gonna run all the way up there. At this, uh, we're gonna build that for stone. Stone production is going up. That is going up as well. Um, skirmishers, key and slingers. I mean, his army isn't the best, to be frank. I'm quite honest, but it's a annoying. So let's see. What do we have with them? They have military access partners with us. They're fighting against. Mm, no, they are non aggression partners with Mycenae after. Okay. We're friendly with them, but we're going down because we have. We don't have anything special. They hate. They, they, they want food. Probably because they don't have that much access to food. Um, so that guy stays there. We'll settle this region as best as we can. See what happens. This city might in itself surrender. Pity that's not to us. Nope. What the hell? Uh, what is Odysseus doing? Good old Odysseus. Oh! Wait, what's. What's to give me that for? He wants this for this, so he wants to give me bronze for stone and wood from me. Counter offer. Trade no, back. Trade regions. No, I don't want that. I want that. Cool. Yeah, um, 
I don't. I don't understand. Nope. I don't understand what you're saying. So he wants to give me non aggression pack. Nope. Trade for stone. How are it? Ah. Plus 500 stone. So the Pharaoh sends us stuff. Keep the gift. We give influence and happiness for four turns, which is alright. We get 600 bronze, which we don't particularly need right now. And we can get 250 gold, which again I'm just earning. So I'll take the stone, and that will allow me to build up my army relatively quickly. Now I could go all the way up here to take Malas back, but that settlement clearly isn't to be kept by us. So for now, after you've regained your strength, this is still going down. Um, hmm. We need to build that really quickly. Um, this is not going to happen for a while. You are plus six, that's good. How are you doing actually? You are minus three. So we'll build you up. And we are a couple of turns away from that, so nothing to do right now. Nothing really much to do. is a keen single barter. No, sir. He wants a peace treaty. Did he lose his settlement? Yes, he did. Uh, and they're demanding my man. No, 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 no. Mission successful. Oh, yeah, we have influence here because salamis were destroyed. Uh, salami is destroyed. Okay. We have a military access, uh, military alliance with them, so we're okay. I can go destroy them. They're a problem. Here's a 20 army. This is going to be a big uh, field army battle. We should win this, but uh, it's going to take some damage. Um, I need to lay an ambush. It's going to be fun. Battle. I have a lap back. Our deployment. Uh, so let's see. Battle map. It's quite flat, but this would give us a little bit extra oomph. So what I'm going to do is these guys have extra range. I'm gonna put them on the front. You guys will be placed here. You guys will come up from this side, and you guys will. Come up from there. You will be in my front line, and you will be in my secondary. Uh, skirmish with guard modes, and you guys will be there. All right. Uh, I think I'm actually going to use groups. That's one. That's two. That's three. That's four. All right. One. I need you to come here. Three, four. And you guys just move like that. It's coming in. You guys run, 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 run as fast as your feet can take you. Swift footed. He's not. It doesn't seem he's interested in attacking us. I mean, the main issue is his archers are at the center of his formation. And I need him to come to me. This is why.
these guys are theoretically still hidden. Okay. If I get the engagement on his archers with, from the rear. It's gonna be a okay. You Jesus Christ, this is beautiful. Do, 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 do. You go there. No, you go like that. You come this way. You come this way. Okay, he's trying to. He's very confused as to what is happening. The foe has sighted your hidden units. All right. Seems we have to charge it. charge in oh. okay here goes nothing you go in there I must say though the f fights are so ridiculously fun And you go attack there. You charge in there. And this is going to be the end of his missiles. The young spears are dying. And they're losing slightly. And... This young spears should die really quickly as well. You come over there. And... You charge into this rear. These guys are racking up the kills like no tomorrow. You go into that. And this charge is going to do damage. Uh, shoot into there. Yeah, instantly. Instantly breaking them. Okay. Shoot at, no, shoot at those guys. This guy's 66 kills in. You are at 120. Oh my god. That Bowman unit is going to get massacred. And this guy is raking up the kills. It's nobody's business. Okay. You guys go there. Charge into that. We lost some units over here, but. Break there. Um, kill this, please, sir. Okay, you are destroying that, and I need you to rear charge those spearmen. And those archers are retreating. Okay, I think we won. Uh, where are my 148? 144. Oh my god, beautiful. Uh, Menelaus. And recharge this blob. Ooh, my militia didn't do so well. Okay. You go there. You come over here. And we won. And battle. GG! That was that was fun. We actually really out, out maneuvered him. These guys are so good because they do get 200 kills. <laughs> Rear charges are so much fun in this game. Why is there no sound? Oh, sounds bad. So yeah, I mean, 200 kills. Uh, these Laconian X-Men, not as effective as I expected them to be. But these light runners are... Yeah! Jesus Christ, they're so much fun.
uh, like ripped his missiles to bits. So if you kill, we'll get more morale, but I need replenishment uh, since we are... Oh, we destroyed him. Okay, cool. Close. Oh, so we are in our own territory. Cool. Um, actually, I'm just gonna stand here and then get off and uh, do my thing. I'll go take this settlement back and maybe even take... It was this settled. Yeah, this was settled by the iOS. I'll try to take these down and just make a push towards um, Troy, which is... Yes, Troy is all the way up there. Uh, pain in the ass considering that uh, that's Hector of Troy's army. So, how are we doing here? Hmm. We have the mud bricks, which is cool, but we need this gives us plus ten percent more. Uh, can we afford the unhappiness? Yes, we can. Okay, we have a level up. So, uh, growth, happiness, nice. Recruitment costs. No, growth and happiness beats this. I mean, it is where he's going, but since he's been conquering a lot. Yeah, this is really important. The, the amount of happiness you get from that, it's going to be a no brainer at higher difficulties. A no brainer. So, I um, think this is it for the turn. We don't really have any problems with m money, and so this campaign is going smooth as butter compared to the other one yesterday. Not wasting any time to go for the next target. The AI, AI is very aggressive. I must say. Nope, no sir. Nope. No, 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 no. I'm meeting a lot of new stuff. I, I kind of am tempted to just wipe out everyone here and just go on like total war spree. We're at war with them, but he has a hard start and considering we just defeated their army down here, we won't be catching up with him anytime soon. Plus there's attrition in deep sea, which I'm not willing to face. So instead, what I'm going to do is I'm going to march. And I'm going to come down this way. So I'm assuming this is all um, Knossos is land, but they these these settlements don't seem to be included. So maybe they're lands we can capture. Frankly speaking, I think I can take this guy out really easily, considering he doesn't really have that many troops. He is uh, Dan Renegades. Uh, okay, so he doesn't like us per se. I mean, he likes us because we have treaties with him and we have military uh, access. Jesus Christ, this guy has a lot of resources. Maybe raiding him would be a good idea. Um, let's build marble marketplace. That's for food. Uh, oh, this gives us extra resources as well. Seven influence, yeah, the influence is going to be a problem. Uh, let's build that and that. Do we have any quests right now? So we need uh, recruit three, it will do that, that's alright. Foreign trade, make a barter to diplomacy, we'll make that. Initiate a Hatakum ritual, which we can do. Uh, wait, I want it for Zeus and prayer. That's good. Uh, in honor of Zeus, divine favor, uh, mission issued, we should be able to get there. Wait, let's do a treaty. 
barter agreement that should yeah. that should give us the foreign trade fantastic so we're sorting out the quest really fast creatures of legend recruit a mythical units uh we have to wait for that and mythical units will appear in your pool um if we look at the gods though jesus son of a bitch this guy takes a while all right uh takes a while to go up but hopefully we'll be able to take him up especially when we build the building and and turn Why would I want to do that? I'm kind of getting anxious since my army is so far away from my land. Uh, no. Alright, we have a mythical unit, prayers answered. So we need to capture all of These are all the way up there. Prison, so oof. Damn. Okay, that is a long-term objective. Non-aggression impact through diplomacy. Those are the, those are the quests. Um, is this who I think it is? Who are these guys? Uh, diplomat raider, they are roads, they are non aggression partners. Okay, well, you have a decent defense, yes, you do. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Um, well, I just took offense to your land, and you have wood over here. And this is just, yep, yep, I took a big fancy to your land and I'm gonna take it. Uh, yeah, Jesus, he has a guard house. Uh, it's gonna be a tough fight. Um, but we'll get to see a siege, so I'll take these two. Well, let's see what I'll match. Actually, wait, I want to see something. Uh, where is it? This, I was building this, so this gives me type of gold. I need this, and to that there. Uh, also, there's no growth. Why are we losing people? What is it? There are buildings here that. What? We're losing roads. There's ten. Don't understand. I really don't understand. Problem is, there's gonna be rebellion soon, and that's gonna be a pain in the ass to deal with. Okay, let's recruit. Hey, Dylan, what's up, my man? We're gonna recruit a spy. Uh, this guy has coward. 10% movement range. A success. Coward. Koi. Uh, we like a coward. And I need you to come all the way up there. Okay. Holy crap, who's here? Jesus, this is a settlement and a half. Good morning, Dylan. Good morning. And what can I do? Can I put this? No, because I can't. I do that. Oh, Jesus, that's cost that. Oof. All right. Uh, wait. Let's build that and build this, because this is more important. Yeah, that will fix our unhappiness issue. 
and uh, he's going for Melos. It's fine, and we are just landed here. What can we recruit? Ooh, we we'll get a giant Vanguard. Ooh, how spicy! Ooh. Ooh. Spicy. And it's not that. Ooh, we've recruited a creature of legend. We have a mythical creature. So what's happening in the campaign today? We're playing a Sparta. We just recruited a uh, giant vanguard, and then we're, they're basically good versus gates. So we started all the way up here. Oh oh oh! <laughs> Hello. Hello. Satyrs are a really good fun unit. They provide uh, instantly constructed all all buildings in a target settlement. So they will do really well uh, once I, you know. The problem is I have eight turns, but standing passive makes the area much happier. Uh, that's going to be really nice. I built a spy, so I'm doing well. Doing very well. One second, guys, I'll be right with you. Uh, is the game you think it was worth the hype? Um, that's a difficult question to answer. Good evening, buddy. Uh, so, a friendly proposal. It was worth the hype. I can't really answer that question because I haven't played it thoroughly, but is it a decent game? Does it have a lot to offer? Yes, it does. Uh, it's. It seems to be very, very well made. Uh, and, uh, again, just... Oh, why this guy? This guy really wants my settlement. No, I won't give it to you. It is really well put together. Let's put it like that. And um, an axe of Crete. So I need. There, Latos, and up there. Okay, so I need to capture all of these somehow. Uh, one way or another. So. Uh, this is going to be a war. They have roads. Do not call your allies for help. Uh, we will not win this fight, but I'll build a couple of those and continue siege. And we'll attack once they go down in. Why is it? Why is it not receiving enough for smooth streaming? Uh, Yarl, what's up? How did I get the game already? Uh, I got it from CA. They, uh, how are you doing, buddy? Uh, they, I'm, I'm a verified content creator with CA now. They gave it to anyone who has 500 subs and more and passed through their verification. Because he's cool. <laughs> we didn't say cool, but so growth. How can I get growth? How the hell do I get growth? Only an X-Men, that's great, but I need growth. Isn't there a growth building, possibly? Jesus, this is an expensive Master Carpenter. This kills growth, definitely. So let's build that. 
You're 100. Dude, you'll get there. Absolutely, you'll get there, buddy. It's uh, prayer to Zeus. Uh, all except Bartus. Ooh. Okay, cool. So, Zeus helps you barter shit. It's campaigns when you're in a city, you never get attacked. When you're in a city, you never get attacked? What do you mean? Uh, same thing. No, 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 no. They, they, do, they do attack. They do attack. They do attack. And they attack with a vengeance. The thing is, cities are really, really hard to beat. So, they make sure that they have a really uh, big army before they attack you. Because the cities actually provide a ridiculous defense bonus, which, you know, walled cities are meant to have. Um, you're meant to have a very strong de defensive uh, bonus. And that's why it's actually, you need to starve out the settlement before attacking it, and still you lose a lot of troops. Because they're, you know, walls, ar archers, etc. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, he wants peace. He's at war with Hector of Troy. Or he's at war with everyone. He's giving me 4,000 food. He's lost most of his territory. Is he at war with one of my allies? No. Uh, yeah. I mean, you're gonna die soon, so it's alright. Uh, Candence, a battle speed only, it's fantastic. Uh, cool, call level up. Oh wow, uh, flood. This is not good. Uh, where? Oh shit. Yeah, this city is not gonna be doing well. Let's build that. Um, she's Son of a bitch. Uh, wait, I thought oh, he didn't take you out. So, ah. so, this settlement has. Wait, let's see what army it has. Shield is. Yeah, it has a really good roster. Um, we need three more turns to be able to attack, but we got. Uh, Javelin's continue siege. This is on hard difficulty. Uh, Dylan. Um. But as of tomorrow, I'll be playing on Legendary. 20. Oh, I can actually get this. Uh, armor. That's good. But what I need now is that. Because I'm not getting that bonus. And I'll get to this happiness. Uh, construction. There. So that's our next 18 turns. I'm being very careful. I'm, I'm taking my time to understand what's happening. It just takes its toll, you know. Wow. Odysseus uh, who wants to give me... Yeah, I'll take that. Food is a big thing. The Amazons! No, go ahead, go to hell. With enough light spear runners, I can, I can rack up hundreds of kills. The light spear runners are the best unit in the game. Jesus Christ, they're so much fun. Feed the fisherman, uh, and. Yeah, feed the fisherman. Poseidon Angers grows, a uh, small quake. Okay, so Troy is not having fun. That settlement will soon assault it. Uh, food, we're doing well. Uh, let's see. Uh, da -da 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 this army is a decent army. You are okay. Uh, growth is going to be a pain in the arse there. So let's see. What can I build? Um, food. So if I build that, Jesus. If I build this, uh, this takes four turns. Mistakes for turns. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, I just let it be. Let it run its course. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, 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 wait. That takes four turns. How many turns do we have? We have two more turns till we get to have to click up to this. 
when we click up to that I'll use this on the settlement and everything will be done and we'll be tier 4 quite early on um, so uh, and turn again uh, Poseidon's bounty so yeah okay cool see you later simping good night buddy They've ended their non aggression pact with you. So, 865 wood. Wait, who is this? The Anatolians. No. Is he? What? Raising strategic threat. They kind of really like. Oh, yeah, that's why they're giving so much good stuff. Zeus. Good old Zeus. All right, uh, rebellion imminent. Where? Over here. And we are going to upgrade this. And I am going to build a warlord here. Gives us a little bit extra oomph and recruit three of those. Instantly going to minus seven hundred. The supply lines. Oh, it's like it's around twenty five percent. Jeez, twenty five percent for food. They will get damaged next turn. So hopefully this army gets uh, summoned before they do. But there is this army over here who will help defend us. Uh, hopefully, usually they do, but who knows and next turn we'll be able to click on that and that's good stuff for us then we'll use the set here my scene okay he didn't did he oh, i don't know if he did he didn't let us know it's a lot of factions though Corinthians. I think the Corinthians could be a good playable uh, faction later on. Single barter. Yeah, I just agree. Just, just, just keep them happy for now. Decline. He knows that he's gonna be my little thing. Um, oh, that's where the rebellion. No. Oh, he cleared up the rebellion for me. Nice. So I need to recruit three of these anyway, so might as well. So who should I recruit? Theoretically speaking, the Shield Clubman will be better. And I'll use them to sort of balance the problems here out. Uh, up, oh, wait. wait, 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 wait. So we can upgrade that and Okay, he departs, close, success, instant, oh, that is amazing. And this gives us more influence, uh, envoys. Okay, we can recruit an envoy, we'll build that as, as well. That is amazing. So we have a tier four settlement now. Uh, wait, we can also, no, that's tier five. That's tier five, wow. What does this do? My recruitment cost of heroes, upkeep, armies in this province, construction cost of all main buildings in this province. Alright. Um, food warehouse. It basically makes you get more food and wood. This, these are really nice for economy, but we're gonna go from there um which is really cool we're gonna recruit those and finish this quest fractured kingdom does it have to be no just general core to heroes with the achaeans menelaus mycenae and down here and then use tablet so these guys are at half strength now you're gonna see me suffer you're gonna see me suffer guys Let's 
Seata. That's a really good settlement. Uh, dry. Start the point. So I'm going to attack. Uh, I think this wall is. Jesus Christ. Uh, maybe attacking here would be the best. So we'll have the high ground. It's very, very defensible settlement. Um, let's attack over in here. I have no fear the Greece is here. Jump on VC, buddy. These guys can't hide, can they? No. Okay, I'm gonna keep them in reserve. These are the giant units. Like if I was to compare them with a light unit. Like it's just, you know, large men carrying shields. Uh, what else is new? Okay, so you guys go like that. And I need you on this hill. And I'll take you here and try to shoot from the flanks. And you will prepare to break in this side. You will hold here. Make coffee and shit sort of. Alright man. Take your time. These guys will need to break through the center and Melaneos breaks through the center. Alright. And you guys need to skirmish him down. This is, keep in mind, this is with him at half strength. It's gonna be a bloodbath. I need you to come here. You know, I need you to come there to take the shots for me. And I need you to come forward as well. It's a different story when you actually get your... Uh, your units leveled up and you have the artillery and stuff like that not artillery sorry the siege towers but it's still a pain in the arse to deal with you guys come here actually get on the walls there and i need you to not guard modes and go there you three i need you to get on the walls there you go there. Never, by the way, guys. Is this game hard to run? Oh, it's on. It's actually not that bad. It's quite optimized from my experience. I'm having a problem with it uh, if I run it on high graphics while I'm streaming. But when I'm not streaming, I run it on um, high slash ultra graphics and got decent, decent results. Like my PC wasn't, you know, wasn't chugging. I would put it in the realm of. Just break down the gate. I would put it in the realm of Warhammer. So it's breaking there. We're getting these guys on the wall. Um, I need you over there. I need you to come here and shoot over there. These guys getting on the wall. Beautiful. Okay. You guys get ready to charge in. And these guys are on the wall. Just uh, just enough FYI, these guys can fall off the ladders and die if they're shot down. Like here, so you see some of them dying. And the generals can die as well instantly. What the hell is... Oh my god. No. What, why isn't... What? Oh, he can destroy the gate himself. Alright, uh, where are my X-Men? Go help him. Get on the walls, do the damage. Um, fire at will, and you go after that. You should be able to break that. And the gate is going down really fast. You get ready to charge in. Okay, charge in. Go in and you just deploy there. Do we have any units left? No. These guys are in and they're gonna start racking up the kills. Oh, I had a little trouble in 1212 video in very high graphics. Do you think this will be a problem? I mean, 
if you had problem with 1212 AD, which is a five-year-old game on high graphics, you'd still be able to run this, but you, you'll probably not see the, like, you know, running, this is on medium, and it looks okay on medium. Oh, shit, these guys are getting surrounded. Um, okay, just come over there, clean that up. Um, I need you to go over there. Where are my giants? Just, just charge in. Uh, kill those up bowmen before they murder you. Should I, wait, wait, slow motion. Cinematic shot. Look at the arrows. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Okay. So, you guys are getting slaughtered. Uh, you're doing the thing I expected you to do, kind of, but not quite. Uh, you are fighting on the wall against that, cool. Uh, you guys uh, shoot at that. And get in the city. Oh, cool. They are not routing. Oh, the guys on the wall. Yeah, and the guys on the wall. That's always the same case. Uh, you should be able to deal with that. Okay. You are murdering these archers. Of Intel Core i5. Yeah. Then you're gonna you're gonna be running. But I am running this on a gaming laptop with a 1060. I have a Core i7 and 16 gigs of RAM. But you're gonna be able to run this absolutely fine. These guys are actually winning. Jesus. You go there, run into that rear, uh, keen slingers, um, shoot over here, let's go back to normal difficulty, assault and battery, alright, you should be able to break that, oh, they think these guys went in... Uh, yeah, they're gonna attack non-stop uh, till they break everything. These guys getting rear charged is not good, but they're do well. They're giants, so I have the GP63 Leopard 8R3 MSI lap PMing laptop. So I need you to come here. I need you to come there, and you charge up this way. That guy is broken. Okay, just come up here and. These guys held their own. We're going to try and go to the capture point, force them to retreat off the walls. These guys are holding their line pretty well. And I need you to just set up like that. And you set up behind them. Kill everything. Wait. Oh, I forgot to give them speed. Okay. Go up there. Quickly, boys. Jesus, do you have overheating issues? Uh, not really, no. I, again, if I put it on maximum graphics, yes, yes, it's, it's it it overheats, but otherwise it runs really well. Just what I did, I got myself a decent cooler and I cleaned it. Uh, like I gen, I threw in a um, one of those air uh, compressed airs and just shot it from the sides. I also know how to open it myself as well, so there's that. So he's trying to run. Jesus Christ, I just need to get you to get there. Come on. Quickly. Army loss penalties should be any second now. You guys are doing more friendly fire than anything, but I need you to come here and get prepared to shoot at anything. These guys are sprinters. Look at them go. Look at them go. Look at them go. And they, they're just so nice looking. Oh, dude, I was going to get the Predator. I ended up getting this because it was slightly cheaper. I think it was 150 pounds cheaper. But, yeah, good choice, man. Okay, you guys go here. Uh, he has a few troops on this side. I think he broke. These guys lost half of their men. Like, these guys cost twice as much as these to recruit and did barely... Close amount, same amount of damage. And battle. It's very hard to open. What do you mean? Open what? 
Oh, the bottom dude, same here. I have to use a credit card, but uh, if you follow online guides, it's usually all right. How to do it? Uh, how how long have you had it? Because thermal paste usually lasts up to four years. Uh, occupy. Yeah, this is good to have that because then we can get those guys up there. And Athena, nope. We're all Zeus's boys. Look how much damage we took, and that was a damaged uh, settlement. Six months. Dude, you don't need to change your thermal paste, it's all good. What you need is to make sure it has proper venting, uh, proper vents, and you'll be alright. Oh, he doesn't want peace anymore. So he's built up his army again. Which means he probably is gonna come up here. But I run all games on all that. That's why it overheats then. Don't run it on Ultra, because then your PC will struggle. 1060 is not the most powerful graphic card. And an i5 isn't uh, necessarily made for gaming, heavy gaming. Like, you'll play the basics, but you won't be able to do much more than that. So, after we take Lato. Is it his final settlement? Looks like a waste of time to me. Uh, Confederation Trade Regions. No, he. Hmm. He has two regions, so he probably has. Okay, he probably has this as well. We'll go take it. Um, but this army is gonna heal. And can I recruit anything instead of this trash units? Uh, I got Troy earlier because CA gave it to me. I got early access. They were very kind. Believe me, very excited. Very, very excited. Uh, I think I can end turn. I mean, the food is being a little bit worrying, but I think we can fix that soon. I genuinely, from what I saw, incredibly competitive. Like, I'm very excited to see what they're going to do with multiplayer. Because the battles are so, like, you need to learn the game. Like, you can go in and just smash units together always, but there's micro intensity, intensity and I like that. That's a nice feature. Oh god. Um, trusted friends. Jesus. Non-aggression pact. Uh, yeah, because we have a mission to do so. United against us. That's all right. Uh, proponents in the sky. Recruitment costs in this region minus four happiness. Where is this? Okay, it's all right. Poseidon. Okay. Fair but fair. All right. Um, We should be able to take this without much of a hassle. I might lose these guys, but I don't really care about them that much. Um, I'm gonna still fight the battle myself because these are strong units. And I don't want to end up losing my light spear runners.
You would want to try and keep all your units alive as long as possible. Uh, so that, oh, it's this one. This one they'll end up. If they do as they always do, we might be able to get a choke point victory over here. You do that, uh, and you guys come here. You just come over there, and you block this region. You go over there. We're gonna make a uh, sandwich. Fire at will. Okay, they are engaging. Giving us their backs is not a good idea, even though they're shielded. Their shield is really good because it gives them a lot of missile block chance, but this is a really good way of killing them. Oh, this is a massacre. Just... Okay, it seems they're not committing everything, so... Let's just do that. And let's just charge them. You pull back. Shoot at them, and you shoot at them. Force him to attack us. Okay, taunted. And shoot into this rear. Jesus, they're fast. Okay, you guys come over here. That unit is dying pretty quickly. This unit over here will die. Yeah. Clearly. This unit also died. Cool. Shoot at them. And you pull back as well. And you come forward. Jesus. You charge in there. And you charge in there. Throw your peel into the rear. That unit is dying. These guys, they're kind of holding, but okay, we'll just charge in. And you go clean that up. No. You come over here. And the volley is about to come in, so run the hell out. Kill that, break that unit, this unit, pull back, those bowmen are being a pain in my arse, you come over there, okay, the yeah, is mostly broken, oof, that was a really good rear charge, And with that heal probably be fine. Yeah, my warriors over here are not doing well. Pull them back. You guys charge into those slingers. You charge in and I need you to start coming up here. You just go there and we won. Holy shit. Uh, 
interesting fight. These guys, my top killers of almost every game. Decisive victory. Uh, occupy. No, we need an occupy. Easier. Uh, so, ooh, we found Heracles' sword. Uh, cool. That's a lot of damage. Cool, cool, cool. And we have. We don't need that. We need growth. That's not how you get growth. Province satiated. Okay, so I'll take. Happiness and growth. And that's going to be important. That's wood. Uh, we can. Will there be another rebellion here? Two. How long has it been to recruit these guys? It's taking forever to recruit. Call to arms as well. Uh, no, is there no? There is no settlement that's available to conquer. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Depletes local deposit. What? What do you mean? Does this deposit have a limit? Oh! Interesting. So gold runs out. And you have a deposit of three times. Damn! That's a detail. Okay, oh, well. That's a detail, good to know. Um, so that gives you deposit of gold. Uh, do you have a deposit of... No. So gold has a deposit limit. On that is so good. So you can't have a gold mine that r runs on forever. Nice. So, favor us, clipless. Replenishes high points of friendly target units. That's. Ooh. Okay. Shield wall. Yeah. Yeah, I won't be getting that. I'll get shield wall and. It's missile resistance, basically. Good. And he is uh, so he has a unique sword and Menelaus shield. That's good and that's good. Maybe it's time to attack Knossos. How can we do Um. Hmm. I mean, we'll see what we do. We'll see what we can do. He's running away with this. Question is, does he have an army here? No, so the army is probably on its way to forwards here. Which means that I need to start force marching this boy up. This bad boy's taking his sweet ass time to recruit. Okay, Dante. Hector of Troy. He's a very strong character. Hmm. Why? Oh wait, I, I un unzipped it. Jesus Christ, though. Agamemnon really runs forward. So 
So they want military access. Pillar. Support if you uh, want to become faithful. Allah, where should you betray him? Vengeance with them. Pillars will be merciless. Okay. Um, military access. Yeah, sure, why not? Mm, no, sir. Okay, we've gotten this. That's cool. Colonize uh, Spartan Ingenuity. That's a really good bonus. Um, you go over there. And you level up as well. Again, um, casualty replenishment. Ho wait, 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 wait. 400 food per turn, plus 2 influence. 100 wood or 60 stone. And then the other one is casualty replenishment. Oh, you can actually get uh, replenishment in enemy territories. Oh, but this is amazing. And then get uh, stone, because stone is... Eventually, because... We can get light chariots. And then we can get a heavy chariot over there. I think you can get a heavy chariot as well somewhere else. I'm not sure how, but... Interesting. Interesting. Oh boy. Jesus, I'm tired. Um, yeah, just merge and uh, they're not the best unit, so recruiting these guys would be nice, but you know, hemorrhaging resources there. So instead, I'm going to get two more of those boys. And because it's costing us four additional upgrades, so it's not that much. But this, since we don't have a bronze, uh, such good units though. Such good units. I mean, I recruited them simply for the quest. But oof. Okay, let's just take away two of them. It's not bad. Alright. Um, happiness here is plus four. Military crackdown is happening, but I need you to run. Uh, I need you to run all the way up there. I'm recruiting two of those. He shouldn't be able to attack us. And then we'll come up here and take it out. And that's road, you know? No, that's the island for Rhodes. And then we'll go take Rhodes. And then we'll invade through the south. An army that can't really be beaten. Uh, envoys. Ooh, we can build more. Let's build this since we have so many resources. Wait, can I build something here? No, no, I cannot. Uh, happiness is still a positive, so we don't really need that. This, this will help. This will help uh, influence and douchebaggery. So resources were going up, boys. Barter agreements. No. Reject the barter agreement. Nope. Ritual of renovation against Lapa. Alright, United against us. Uh, versus Sparta. Wait, who? Um. Okay, that's fine. Ionian. 
bullshittery. Um, oh boy, Jesus, you can travel far. So I'm traveling here all the way here. I'm gonna come here and making sure I have some troops to defend this area. Since I'm not building a defensive building, and I need some more stone for that. He's gonna land here, but he has only three units, so we should be able to deal with anything he sends my way. He's gonna retreat if we do that, so let's just come here. And let's just do this. And we should be able to take that settlement next turn. Um, like to build this. This, this gives you renowned bowmen. Oh, jeez, that's weird. But all right, uh, I think we're okay with regards to building stuff. I'm not. I'm building this stone because I'm not trusting this to be safe. But this is relatively safe. If he attacks me down here, so. Let's build up the wood settlement to tier three. There you go. Uh, the unhappiness here is zero, so it's perfect. It's perfect. And how are my agents doing? Um, it's been sitting here for a while, so we'll just go up that way, and we'll come. Oh yeah, I know where this is. This is I've seen it before in my Odysseus campaign. And you, you good sir. Jesus, it is, it is. Oh, sorry, Achilles campaign. Achilles is doing some decent damage there. So Thebes is here. Hmm. The city of Thebes. We can go take it out. We ruin it. All right. And this guy has four motivation. Uh, cool. He's a warlord of the Kiro spy. Okay, let's end the turn. Hey, dude. Hey, buddy. What's up? Uh, you know. Sorry? You know, just waking up. Good morning, sir. Oh, Jesus. This campaign is so the, much more uh, fun. How's it going? This campaign is really much more fun than uh, in every single direction. Gotcha. And people actually like you. I was going to say, do you have diplomatic uh, bonuses with everyone? Is that why? Or? No, you don't. But I found out, like, so with Paris, I was going with the growth route. So I was getting as much growth as possible. So I was going for uh, Aphrodite, so she gives you growth bonuses. And then I was going for okay. Apollo, which gives you missile advantage. And in this one, I went with Zeus. And Zeus gives you ridiculously good diplomatic uh, benefits. Okay, okay. And uh, it's... Jesus Christ, no, I'm not going to give you 8,000 food, you can go to hell. And uh, also the positioning of, of, of Sparta starts at the corner of the map, so it's always that slightly easier. Sparta? You're not playing as Oh, you are playing as Sparta. Yeah, yeah, oh, okay. Sparta. For some reason in my head I was thinking um, Agamemnon was who you were playing as. No, I'm playing as Menelaus. Agamemnon is disgustingly powerful. Yeah, I mean Sparta's got a good starting location, a hundred percent. Ooh, oh, fuck happiness. The People's Feast. Okay. Jesus, that took a while. Research takes ages in this game. Interesting. I mean, in some games it has seemed like research was too fast. Yeah. And then they was basically just waiting your forty turns to get your end tier units, kind of thing. So. Mm. Absolutely. That makes sense. Wait, am I fight war with this guy? No, I'm not. Am I? Am I? What? No, I'm not. Okay, cool. Whew. Uh, who am I at war with that's close to me? No one. Oh, that's good. That's good to know. <laughs> <laughs> that's always good to know. It's always a positive. I say. It's, uh, like, once you get a few settlements under your belt, it's really nice because you start getting a lot of resources. It has, like, another thing I discovered is, oh, Jesus Christ, this is a, not a wall. No, it's a wall set. Oh, dude, sieges are such a painful experience. <laughs> like, in a good way. 
but so I discovered like there there are gold cities right where you can get like you can mine gold. There is a okay. limited amount of gold that you can mine from each settlement. Oh, like after the gold runs out, you only get ten percent of what you're making before. Interesting. So it's a fine kind of like a, yeah, kind of like an Age of the Empire sort of thing. Yeah. Then you need to make the rest by trading or by like you always have a background income of gold, but it's a trickle. Which is nice. But now I need to destroy a Gamanmon, because he's pissing me off. And I don't like him taking my lands. Actually wait, can I trade with him for those settlements? I, anticipate coming out of this world. I need Lappa and... Wait, no, no, no. Ooh! I forgot you can do the trade settlement thing again. Decline. Wait, if I do trade regions, I want... What, what's this? That is called Aptera. Canodia. Oh, he, he only one. So can, he doesn't even consider having two trade settlements. Uh, barter agreements. You will offer... Uh, Two, four, seven. Yeah, and there's no way he's gonna do take this. That's single barter. Two. How many turns are you in? Uh, around thirty. Yeah, so you're still on the Greek islands, or what? Yeah, I I went down to Crete. I took over Greek uh, Crete, and now I'm going up nice, nice. Um, from Rhodes into the uh, Trojan. Island rear. hop. Yeah, basically. Okay, island hopping basically. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna try and buy this settlement from. No, it's impossible. I'm giving him everything, and he's he's not. Now you said there was a mechanic for colonizing. Yeah. Uh, so it so it's called. Have you tried Spartan that yet? Colonies. Or? Yes, I have, and uh, it's. So you you know when you colonize, usually you pay a number yes. of set amount of resources, etc. Yep. Yeah. You pay twice or three times according to the distance that they are. But then you colonize okay. it without any penalties. Nice. And you can start building. The thing is, it needs to be a raised settlement, which at 33 okay. turns in the campaign, there are not that many of. There's not as many. Gotcha. At the start, there are a few, which you can see. Oh, and it has to be within your site. So it, you have to have something close by. You have by. to. Gotcha. Like an ally or yourself to be close by. I'm currently sending uh, my priests around and my spies around trying to figure out uh, stuff. I really, like, I got a satyr, which is basically just a bard, and he has the ability that if you use him on your city, it instantly completes everything you have. So Ooh. I went from tier 3 to tier 4 in one turn, which is ridiculous. Cause How they, often can you use that? Uh, once, and, it, and the unit itself, gotcha. you get it after an epic quest, and it disappears. Okay, so it's like a, it's, I gotcha. Okay. I mean, that's a neat little thing. Yeah. It's nice that the units kind of like, they're strong, but one to get it took me forever. Like I had to do like four different, quite difficult quests. And once you get it, like you have only eight turns to use it. So if you, unless you plan for it. Why is he trying to steal my settlement? Uh, Odysseus wants a defensive. He wants me to give him, to, 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 to sod off. What? No. The, their barters are just increasingly worse. It, well, not increasingly worse. So when I had really high, um, probably I just need to get another sacrifice to, to Zeus. When you do gotcha. like a sacrifice to Zeus, you give, it gives you like 20 or 30 or I think even 40 if it's really high. Let's see where I am. Yeah. So, so it's kind of like the, um, the influence system on Warhammer for um, the High Elves. Yes. Yeah, basically. Just with buildings instead and sacrifice. Yeah. So I oh, okay. I have the prayer to Zeus uh, active, which is plus fifteen evaluation for all diplomatic arguments except barters. And then so it means people like you more. But then he gives you descendants of Zeus, and messenger of thunder. 
and heroes and agents are 51st and cheaper which is nice and if you get him to tier 3 you get the minotaur that you can recruit and you can get happiness per defensive or military alliance per turn faction wide okay, okay. easy but to get him up there worshipped it's just absolutely yeah. impossible Minotaurs are basically a berserker unit right yep yeah and it's very weak like gotcha. so i got a unit it's more of, of a you hit them in the rear sort of unit yeah it's a one shot like glass cannon you can't even like pull him out and r run him back in because he'll die like you need to when you use him you need to make sure that it's the finishing blow so i have also gotten some giant vanguards which are something similar they do damage like they melted a unit of archers but when compared them with light spear runners which are like you know very light infantry with just high speed the light spear runners got 200 kills nice so i was like hmm this is this is interesting okay uh i think i'm gonna add this turn as well and giant vanguard runners are basically just your your big men your like your grenadiers in the uh, gunpowder age sort of thing the giant vanguard runners yeah in the, they're not actually giants right no 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 they're they're just big boys yeah, yeah, like Grenadiers were. They were picked because of their size. Did you? Really? I didn't have no clue. Generally, yeah. Uh, their size and their ferocious... Eh. I messed up that Ferociousness. word. Ferociousness. Ferocity, Ferocity, yeah. Okay. They're also, for, I used... Um, so in the video that's coming up this evening, I used um, the Cyclops. And the Cyclops okay. gets an ability where he just throws... Like, it's like... It says something like... Toss or... Boulder, and he bas you basically see him lean down to the ground, pick a boulder, and fling it at his enemies. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it kind of does morale damage rather than damage, because <laughs> it's very inaccurate. Um, no. Where did this guy come from? Oh my god. Oh, oh, seriously, I just upgraded the settlement, well, I'm in the process of upgrading the settlement, one, two, three, four, six, yeah, I'm dead, no, yeah, six units of bloody missiles, so is this just a, a minor faction on the map somewhere, yeah, that basically. you're fighting, yeah, I'm taking their. I took their capital in like a uh, sneak uh, attack, but apparently they had. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this is the same one, but one of them had their army still roaming, and I didn't realize. But their army is ridiculously weak. It's just that my army is a bit far away. Now the other question is, how are the army stacks for like one city factions? Do they get like the same thing in Rome where they're running around with like three full stacks or? They get lots of small stacks and run around with them. So the, the, they do lots of hit and runs and then they'll have two main armies or three main armies according to how large the settlement is. But from okay. what I understood in uh, Legendary, it gets, it's similar to Warhammer and Legendary where they have a yeah. lot of bonuses. But again, you expect that. Yeah, yeah. What I like is the shields are so important. For example, these giants have 60% missile resistance once they have their shields up. But if they don't have their shields up, they die really quickly. I mean, yeah, I mean, that's a mechanic that makes total sense. Yep. Okay, my army is routing instantly. My archers. Oh, my archers. Oh, I forgot. To t oh. Yeah, this didn't go well. Didn't, I, I barely did any damage. I killed one giant. No, till two giants. Okay, I killed a few. Hey, you gotta look at the small victories. You're calling them small, how dare you? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, oh, you can rematch. Maybe this is a, uh, a because it's a review copy. I think it's because it's a review copy you're allowed to do a rematch. Probably it will be removed. 
Because technically speaker is technically speaking I'm a reviewer. Yeah. Oh god, I can't believe. Oh, it sounds so dirty. Jesus. Oh, for fuck's sake, he took one of my stuff. <laughs> That's gonna be painful. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's the guys I'm fighting. Oh, fuck's sake. Uh, and. Oh, no, they're gonna take my gold settlements. Um. So he did take a little bit of damage. Um. Let's see if I'll make it on time. I doubt I will, but let's see if I'll make it on time. Okay. Holy crap, this guy has armor giant spearmen. Yeah, I'm not attacking the settlement. Just gonna keep sieging it till they give up. Um, why is my notifications on Facebook pinging up? <laughs> uh, so I, I was having a bit of a hard day today. I woke up quite early, but yeah, I, I was trying to study and it wasn't going well. And after I managed to reach my word quote of the day, I put. Um, so I have double or triple chocolate uh, brownies, which I just basically found all the chocolate in my house, placed them in the brownies and baked them. <laughs> and then I found, I I, rem I forgot about this, but I found that I had bought buttercream icing, vanilla buttercream icing, and I just put three servings on two double serving of brownie and I ate it and I couldn't stop smiling. <laughs> I mean, I doubt that you blame me for it. No, I don't. I don't. I get it. I get it. Just probably my veins are not that <laughs> happy. With I me. went um, I went out at 2 a.m. in the morning um, to an ice cream. Well, it's not an ice cream spot. It's a fast food spot. And I bought two large ice creams and absolutely demolished them. Aww. So, yeah. Son of a bitch doesn't share. That's basically when you woke up and I was uh, harassing you guys in the chat. Yeah. I just realized something stupid about my flooding, by the way. Oh? When we get the uh, Ender Dragon again, it's going to destroy all of it. Will it destroy the water, though? Yes. <laughs> oh. I, I remember that. Okay, afterwards. well, maybe we should spawn him in the maximum times, kill him, and then all, all of us will just pitch in to redo it. Yeah. Um, Hissing Salmon is built a ridiculous mob farm like they uh, nice. I, I'm kind of scared because it might provide a ridiculous amount of lag to the server but it's quite impressive. I mean if it does we just TNT it yeah or reduce it to he can only use it if there's one person online yeah he, he I told him that so he, he's gonna try and do that but when I, when he was building in the area I teleported to him to see what was happening and was like holy shit it is a really big operation. Like, I'm impressed. Genuinely impressed. They basically use the half slab method of uh, water, pushing the, the, the mobs off with water, and then they kill them on yeah, magma yeah. blocks. But today okay. he uh, is, told me he's going to build the Enderman farm for us. So that's, oh, cool, cool. that's going to be nice. Yeah, I got to get over and start uh, working on the, uh, the Guardian. Yeah, actually, if before the Guardian, if tonight I provide you with all the soil, uh, the glass, can you start working on the z zombie one? Because we need that badly, like we need gold badly. I mean, yeah, I can look into it, 100%. I'll start uh, collecting some um, magma yeah. cubes, not magma cubes. Yeah, um, yeah. Mag you know magma what I mean. Blocks. I'll, yeah. I'll make sure you have three or four shulker boxes of glass. Because I gave two shulker boxes of glass to Hissing Salmon to build the Enderman farm, since it's going to be a community one. Oh, 
No, I can't afford that much gold. Jesus Christ. He's like, oh, this looks interesting. He's going to give me like a thousand stone. I'm like, for what? Oh, gold. No. Um, these guys think I'm rich, but I'm really not. Calls level up. Temples and rich versus the freezer. Ooh. Did I reach? Can I? Can I? Really do this? Wait, wait. Yay! Alright! Cost level 3. I have. Jesus Christ, the ritual cost is so expensive. Build that up. Um, where did his army go? That is what I'm worried about. I'm really worried, actually. Oh, that's where his army is. Okay, I'm gonna run away now. Shit, if he goes up here, it's gonna be pain. He has to deal with. Um, recruit, defender. Wait. Okay, now they cleaned up the rebellion. Thank you. So, descendant of Zeus. Cool. But. So, holding three armies, you get. Sub Holy fuck. Fuck me, Christ. 50% increased food upkeep? Jesus. No wonder people were complaining. Let's get some of those boys. Um, yeah. no, actually, no. Two of those. And two, one of those. Yeah, I wonder why people were complaining now. I, well, I wondered why. There's a reason. Um, might need to be tweaked down a bit. On Legendary, I wouldn't mind it to be that high, but not on this difficulty, man. Hector is getting his ass handed over to him. Oh, you guys want peace, huh? And you want me to pay? Sod off. So someone managed to do the first battle of... Um... Achilles with almost zero losses, like 20 losses or something. And he basically, you see Achilles running around the map. <laughs> Just get dodging everything. Oh. Yeah, this guy's dead. That's that's effort. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of annoyed that, they don't, that you don't get seed battles with this. Yeah, like seed battles aren't my favorite thing, but it's 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 nice variety to have. Yeah. You know? Definitely. Close damage buildings, Zeus. Are you serious? But Zeus, what did I do to you? Built you an altar and everything. Jesus Christ, how the fuck am I gonna. Don't want to waste two more turns here. Don't want to damage my army. That much at least. The hell should I do? Oh, I'm gonna have to wait another turn. Yeah, settlements are a pain they has to take. They like take so much resources to deal with. Um he's gonna go for Lapa. Build a defense over there. You uh, for glory, my horse. You do that, and you do that. Recruiting an army is gonna cost me an army like an uh, 
Never losing this queen. And third, oh, we're all losses. Morale is a pain in the ass. Uh, Odysseus, thank you for your money. Though you are a scary, scary person. Uh, peace treaty. And you give me bronze. Who are you? And you are a Trojan pillar. Okay. And you're at war with Mycenae. 250 is not worth getting him pissed at me. Oh. I was looking at some uh, maps yesterday. Oh. God dang it. Let's see. Yeah, alright. Now it's easy. Um, we took minor da Jesus Christ, though. Um, occupy, because I don't want to destroy the settlements. It's a tier 2. Ooh! Ooh! Oh! Giant spearmen. All right, this is good. I found a, a good settlement. Nice. Um, Zeus, Sorry, Zeus. Where I can recruit giants at will. Ooh. So there, the way you recruit these mythical units, there are <coughs> special areas where you can build specific buildings. Okay, so it's it's specific to a region. Yeah, a number it's like and every other region has like these unique locations where. The myth you can is that there is, you know, history or something, I don't know. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. It's cool, though. That's a good way to do it. Yeah, I mean, it, it kind of makes sense, you know. So, these guys hate me. No. Yeah, these guys hate me. The Corinthians hate me. This guy loves me. But this guy is in deep shite. Make it work, so let's... Oof. Kind of want to see what happens if I do an ultimatum to force someone <laughs> to join me. To confederate them or alliance? Yeah, force them to confederate me. Because... I mean, we are military ally allies already. Does it give you the the chance of success like Warhammer does? Mm, yeah, it's actually uh, much better. It gives you actual value. I really want to see if this were. I mean, so he has one army left, which if he loses, I'll probably be able to take him into my fold. Developing regions is ridiculously expensive. I mean, it should be though, really. I like, I like how they're trying to slow the game down a little bit. It seems. Yeah. Because in Rome, like I, like I said earlier, you just the whole rush, especially depending on the faction, Absolutely. is just slamming out your best buildings so you can get the most OP units to just slaughter. And spam. Even that, not even that, it's just spamming the. Yeah. Co magical yeah, combination of units. Yeah, yeah, no one really takes the time to to play the game as a campaign. Mm -hmm. Jesus 
is very well defended. Um, so I can't go there with a small army. Damn, this army is not that small. Um, sufficient funds, yeah, I can't recruit that. So let's recruit those boys. Um, I can't upkeep those. And it just, yeah, we'll, we'll get those. Like, recruiting a second army is hemorrhaging me, like, food. Having a primary army is great, but when you start expanding from there, it's... And the cost of some units is insane. Which, again, makes sense uh, in the way it is. Um, okay, you're gonna rest there for this turn, aren't I? No, I do not want to deal with you. You're a Trojan pillar. And there are factions which are submissive, which are called uh, pillars. They're just the Dan, I don't know how to say it, the Greeks have their own guys. Uh, Hippomenes. Who's this guy? Okay, he's up there. He wants to give me 2,400 wood. I'll accept graciously. Two happiness in own provinces, faction wide, nice. Okay, yeah, I got to, Jesus, that took a while to research. Uh, annex of roads. Okay, so I need to take, Jesus Christ, these are a lot of settlements. And every region you capture, like, for example, Crete, Rhodes, or certain regions, like larger regions, you get special quests and you get special items. Okay, okay. Is there a lot, there's, so there's the main quest line. Yeah, and then you and get then random quests as you're going along. Just random quests throughout. Okay, I like that. I like that. It's one of the reasons I really enjoyed Warhammer, was that there was always something you could go off and yeah. do. Absolutely. If this guy attacks, it's going to be a pain in the ass to deal with. Um, so how is my army over here? 13. Uh, I'm just going to spam these guys out. So if he sallies out, I'll kill him with missiles. If he stays in there, I'll just kill him with love. That's the way to do it. Problem is, this army that's running around, it's pissing me off. Traveling across the deep water is a pain in the ass. Big attrition and slows you down, or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, you need to sh sail close to the shores. Uh, Vasilis, Strav, look at this. The new voice is really suiting to hear. Uh, who's, uh, Greece's voice? Maybe he's in the oh. business. He should be opening, like, uh, you know. An ASMR yeah. channel or something? Ooh, I'd listen to that. Ooh, tickle me. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, tickle my earlobes. Jesus. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna get my YouTube channel shut down. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Oh. I just work here. You're making it sound worse. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, I don't want to deal with you. It's, they basically want all of my money. Like, everyone's beelining for my gold mine. I should win this. I'm not sure about the second gonna fight, go, but I should I'm win gonna this. go for a refill on coffee beer. Back. Oh, I want coffee. Make me one, please. He didn't make me a coffee. Wait, 
where's the capture point? This is the capture point, okay. So Let's see what's going to happen here. It's coming around this way. Seriously, okay. Fast forwards. Guard mode, shoots, shoots, and you come here. Your warriors are losing heart. Done. Your hero is under attack. Jesus. Okay, we're winning. Nice. Victory is close enough. And battle. Too many mugs. Ooh. Clubman, Spears. Um, kill the no even replenishments. Yeah, we won't probably survive the end of next turn. So, mm -hmm. we are not surviving the end of next turn. Claim treasure, uh, influence faction wide, happiness faction wide, cost of envoys, mm -hmm. faction growth, administration efficiency. So we'll do that. And he's gonna come over there. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to deal with, but this rebellion should come back at some point. And this is built, we'll build that. Nestor! That actually kind of triggered something, maybe I don't know, I don't remember exactly what. Um, now, can you treasure, uh, it's treasure, trigger the great, like, invasion of the Trojan lands? Or is that not a thing? Like, is there an event linked with that? I'm not entirely sure. Because I imagine that's a Menelaus thing. Uh, not sorry, a Agamemnon Agam 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 thing. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think you can. Because so for Menelaus, what you do is you, after you do your quests, I imagine there are twelve epic quests, right? So if you look, mm -hmm. I have created the first. I have finished the first stuff. So I have eleven more to go, and I'm on turn fifteen. Um, your aim is to capture Helen, and you have to defeat Hector of Troy, Paris of Troy, and Troy. So I imagine there is, yeah. I imagine there is. Oh, I've explored quite a bit of the map. Yeah, sort of like a, like a crusade mechanic almost. Yeah. 
I mean, from what I understood is if you choose either side, and you can choose either side, you basically by aligning yourself with the so-called pillars of Troy, or pillar or pillars of the, the dance, and then they'll give you diplomatic bonuses to either side. Thing is, I really want to confederate someone. Ooh, wait, Rhodes. Can I confederate Rhodes? No, I'm at war with Rhodes. What if I do this? Peace well treaty. No, confederation is not going to work. I want to create a, make you a vassal. Can I make you a vassal? No. So you're you're getting defeated. Exit negotiations. Um, okay. Tessanians. So you're so far up north. Uh, yeah, it's not even worth confederating you. Mm, what war with you? You are getting your ass kicked. You are getting your ass kicked. Yeah, you're sort of close, but not. You are also not close. I'm still at war with you. Do you want to be at peace? Like yes. And confederate. Jesus Christ. Let's let's uh, let's get peace with you. And all right, you, you, my sir. Why is it so difficult to get a confederation, and you cannot bribe people? I just kill you instead. Uh, Anatolians, no. Narcos, no. Um, Nakiro, sir. No, you guys, no, you guys, no. Of course not. Uh, ooh. I'm happy to deal with King Jesus. Yeah, no one wants to confederate me, even if they have nothing. Maybe you need to have a higher strength rate. Well, I mean, you already do, really. Uh, well, let's see. Where am I? I'm strength rating you're, five. You're five, so yeah, that shouldn't really be a factor. I mean, I'm five with one arm. Well, one and a half arms. Because this arm is costing me an arm and a leg. Oh, wait, I made peace with him. <laughs> I built an army to go kill him. Linksy, linksy, linksy. Oh, I fucked this shit. I'm gonna go find someone else to kill. So I made peace with him. But you, kind sir, how are we at you? You're aggressive. I don't like you being aggressive. No, I'm gonna kill you. Oh wait, you have territories all the way up there. <gasps> How dare you? Do it. Trying to break the game. Yo, Kiltman, what's up? Yeah, I'm trying to find like uh, glitches or some form of uh, bugs. That gives me bonuses. Still now, everything that I found has a safeguard, so can't say I'm doing a good job. Definitely enjoying this campaign, though. Even though if I'm stopping in around 30 minutes, I'm gonna go and try to see some meteor showers. Ooh. Which it means literally probably have a nap in the car i mean there's nothing wrong with a nap in the car yeah exactly napping in general is a good you know it's a favorite pastime it's a, of mine. It, it's a good hobby to have I genuinely expected more people to be interested in um, in Troy than the, the, there is. I, I, I have mean, a feeling it's going to be like a slow growth thing because so many people yeah. are skeptical of the game. It's either going to end up like Thrones or Britannia or it'll be a Rome. I mean, it'll never fully be a Rome because it's only a Saga game, but... The gameplay is good, yeah. At least till now it's good. just gave me the thing I wanted. Oh, okay, I'm no longer angry at you. He raised my settlement. Which I hope to God he doesn't settle now. 
Faction destroyed, Thessalonians. And you guys didn't want to confederate. These guys. So, Spartan colonies. Oh! Oh! Where is this? No, you're too far away. But you! Oh! Ooh. Thank God. Uh, heat is wor okay. Wait, what? Uh, father's grievance. Trine Dame Reus spoke with heart grieving outrage, gripped by murderous, uh, by murderous anger for glorious Menelaus. Your wife's father, Trindeus, becomes gradually more agitated and dour as you tighten your grip on Sparta. The old man finally confronts you at court. Your power grows, Menelaus, but every day. Without your wife at your side, further impedes your claim to the throne of uh, Perseides. The words chafe, yet you see truth in them. Banish, uh, you gain 2,000 experience. Jesus, that's good. And Ire of Melanaeus, you get 10% uh, ten influence faction wide, 10% melee attack for 10 turns. Uh, Melanaeus Wisdom, it's a wise king to listen to the hearts, a bitter rival, or respect. You gain 20 diplomatic relations with the dance. Interesting. Give you a couple of days, then you compare to Rome to... Have you... Yeah, we, we could do that. Heed his words. That 20 diplomatic relations is good. But so is the mm -hmm. in extra influence and 2,000 experience. But those are things that come. This I won't be able to get again. And I might be using that to confederate other factions. Enter in defensive alliance. I am already in a defensive alliance. So I imagine that was another one of my epic quests. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Create. I finished three in a row. Um, he leveled up. So let's see. Divine challenge. Uh, target and cast are forced to fight each other. That's really good. Olympian throw. Throws a spear, causing damage. Fair enough. But wait, uh, this is more important. Stone faction wide. That extra stone is going to be really useful. Malaneus, though, overall is one of the best heroes I found till now. One of the epic heroes that I tried. Uh, He's, I don't know, because I'm comparing him to Achilles. Achilles also has some decent stats, but Achilles basically boosts his army. Manele is yeah. a bit of a uh, actual fighter. Tank, not tank, a uh, fighter, but also he does really good administration. That's what I was trying to say. Marble Angora. Mm, no, I can't build that. Well, I can. This building's fine. Okay. Um. Problem is, I'm gonna run out of bronze, so let's see, let's try again. Because this guy didn't want to confederate, but now it's even worse. Interesting. Oh, okay, wait, exit negotiations, because I need to boost myself the line will. Prayer to Zeus. And had I come to Zeus. Okay, now it should be. Uh, a little bit easier. Are you fucking kidding me? Maybe next turn? <sighs> I mean, this settlement is not gonna get upgraded till next turn. Just wanted to settle it. And end turn. Hector of Troy. Athens apparently is really rich. Shame if someone was to take it. Take it, do it, do it. Are you Shia LaBeouf now? Unleash the dark side. Have you become Shia LaBeouf? Always, always. Do it, do it. Hmm. 
<laughs> this guy's trying to give everything to try and buy me over. Because <laughs> he knows I want to attack him. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> he knows. Ah, uh, prayer answered Zeus. Okay. Oh, so your prayers might not... Ooh. Not answering my prayers. How kinky. That's not how it's doing. Uh, let's build temple to Zeus, my boy, my man, my lovely guy. And uh, let's build this. Might help. But I am running out of bronze, so diplomacy. I need bronze. Uh, you, my sir, are the Arcadians. Okay, negotiate. No, wait, I don't want that. I want so 20 gold for 20 bronze. Yeah, that works. Okay, so bronze is sorted. Uh, it's the one thing I don't have a bronze mine, which is irritating. I like my bones. You should get one of those. Well, I will. I'm about to go take one from the Cretans. So I need wood. I'm out of wood. Dang it. Okay, I'll, I'll just get more wood. Have you done? There are no naval battles. I killed one. They've adopted the Warhammer naval battle system where you fight on the land, like on the shore, kind of. Maybe it's something they introduced later. Naval battles were never the best thing that they had, so... Yeah, it's, they didn't always... It didn't go down well. in that day and age. No. Um, they didn't always look for... It's basically just smashing ships into each other. Basically. Ooh, they were destroyed. What do you mean you try to assassinate my priestess? I'll tell you what, I'm going to give you a prophecy of doom. Don't know what it does. What does it do? Oh, from moving next turn. Okay. Prophecy of Doom! It sounds so crazy. For the name, I'll tell you that much. Sorry? The, the... The consequence of doing it is very anticlimactic compared to what the name is called. Yeah. Yeah, priestesses are not the nicest. I expect a profitable meeting. Uh, do we have... No, I don't have anything to do with you. And you have bronze! Ooh, hello. Hello, uh, Chaos, Jesus Christ, I'm flirting with the bloody, um, wait, what, oh, you're an Anatolian, oh, I can kill you, I think, no, you're one of, crap, you're an Achaean, uh, mm, eh, Nah, nah, I don't know. Decline. I am interested in hearing. 
He has a decent army, but I don't know where it is. I need to start killing something, or else my units are about to start routing. And then Essence will appear, and that's not always a good thing. Yes, it will. We don't want that. No. And this guy's army is not here. God dang it. Where is this guy's army? Oh, he ran all the way here, so he's gonna come up all the way. Son of a bitch. <laughs> he's playing tag with me. I was hoping they would work on them, but it's a hard thing to... It's, it is, yeah. It's a hard thing to nail, and it, it's better not to have it rather than have a shitty version of it. At least that's what I think. We can start building our uh, Cyclopean, Cyclopean Citadel. That would be a nice citadel. He wants a peace treaty. Counter offer. Wait. Don't mind being a peace with you. But I need something from you. Military access and non aggression pact. Single. And I'm going to demand 4,000. 1,000 wood. Uh, let's say uh, 8,000 food. 9,000 food. Uh, 8,500 food. That kind of works. Okay. And some, some gold. That and that. Yeah. Jesus, I'm ripping this guy out of everything he has. <laughs> Do it. Take it all. I just took over 50% of his resources. I never even fought the guy. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, when you do the uh, Zeus thing, people really start to like you. Zeus. So, where is his army going? Yeah, I'm gonna have to resolve this. Occupy. Alright. Influence. So, enemy of the Trojans. That's cool, but this. Unbreakable. Hero frightens nearby units. Morale is so important in this game, so I'll take that. And you heal this up, and you start rebuilding this place from the ground up. Uh, and gold miner stands, you build that, and Jesus, this one is fully developed. Um. 
no, you guys stay there. Lato is developed ish. We got wine. We got Zeus. Wine, and we will build that chieftain's hall for influence. You have that boy. And okay, we finished divine architect, so everything is cheaper. Mm, no. That's good. Four hundred gold. Wait, it's diplomatic. Okay, all right. Yeah, I'll get that. It's one turn. Um, do these guys want to? Okay, I am not going to stop before I get uh, confederation. I like that it's this hard to confederate, but I, yeah, I'm like, oh, I, I need. Mean, yeah, it's just too too easy to confederate. Because then you can become the empire in Warhammer and confederate everyone. And if I confederate this guy, I get bronze, and I really want bronze. Plus, I also get a buffer region between Sparta and Mycenae. And I know Mycenae at some point I'm gonna fight. And I want to be able to just yeet the capital out. Join war against. Troizen, are you? F I'm not sure if you're seeing the the screen, but soon my diplomatic relations is gonna come up. And just on a side note, look how many military access partners and military alliances I have, which is yep. so unusual. Now this mofo wants me to go to war with one of my non-aggression partners. That motherfucker. Yo, bossman, what's up? I'm glad you made another video. It's just, dude, keep in mind this is not the place to come and advertise your videos. Like, please. Like, I'll give you a shout out every now and again. Just ask politely for it. Just don't uh, talk about them here. Ah, <laughs> oh, dude, you don't even know what's coming to you. You have no clue, Crete. You have no clue. Harvest early, uh, all resources faction wide, plus a thousand food. Uh, for how many turns? Four turns, yeah. Buy the wares, minus 100 gold, but you get a crap ton of bronze, which I need, but I can't producing bronze. Uh, minus 10 influence, but then I get a crap ton of other resources, yeah, that's good. Um. Movement at sea, yeah, fantastic. Oh, we love a challenge, okay. So, you are. No one likes you, so, but you have a similar uh, army to mine. So, I'm sorry, but we are gonna have to fight. And everyone just declared war on you. <laughs> oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. <laughs> Uh, I just got all of the Greeks to attack. All right, man. Th thanks for letting me know. Now, I know you were recording a video because you put me in that group. Uh, I'm occupy because I need the resources. And yeah, that's decent. That's decent. Okay, we've got some resources. Uh, Dread of Ares, Moral, no. Uh, Rage, Blood of Hercules. Hopefully we'll take the other settlement next turn. It's alright, Bossman. No, I'm, I was just letting you know because you keep doing it, and I know you don't do it uh, from purpose. Welcome back, Emilia, buddy. I'm just about to leave. I know you don't do it for any evil intent, whatever, or evil intent. It's not even evil intent. A uh, bad intent. Sorry, my my brain is a little bit uh, messed up right now. Um, I'm talking to Bossman. To replenishment, defense. Uh, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of resources. Mm, fair enough. Mm. 
Let's see what army he has. Where is my priestess? Uh, this guy is down here fixing stuff. That's the guy. And what is she doing? Let's figure out what's happening in Macedon. Is this Macedon? This is Macedon right now, though. Where the hell is Macedon? Oh, Macedon is way up there. Okay. Way up there. Alright. Um, can we build somewhere? No. There's nowhere we can build. Um, we're going to take care of that buddy and remove him from our land. You can upgrade this so we can get some Elotion swords. Our food intake is actually increasing thanks to this and our bronze will be in a good place once we get this one sorted as well. I can actually recruit a couple of more of these and one of those. Alright, we're gonna have two full stacks and uh, uh, yeah, I wanted to see if these guys will confed. Bonus is plus 20. Oh, I'm not trustworthy. How the hell am I not? How do you improve your trustworthiness? Okay, I'm gonna save scum this. Because I want to see what happens. Uh, test confederation. I know it, it, it's probably not gonna work, but yeah, reject Try it. it. Try it. I tried it. It didn't work. And now everyone hates me. Yep. <laughs> so <laughs> even attempting to confederate makes people hate you? No, I, I didn't. I just attempt. I told him you either confederate with me or else I declare war on you. He refused. So I declared, uh, and it's an automatic like declaration of war, basically. Sure. It's it's an intimidation factor, which I think would work if you have like four armies surrounding his his location, which I didn't have. Um, okay, let's let's figure out who likes us the most. So he, we're very close to confederating a Gamen one. Okay, okay, Argos. And very, very close. No, not that close, actually. Uh, this guy's interested as well. They're Arcadians. The Arcadians like us. This guy, Jesus Christ, he's strong. Achilles. Um, how is this guy? Why is it so difficult? Hundred. Exits. Uh, do I have anything with them? Yeah, I should just break this. Oh wow. Atti oh, faction attitudes. Okay, people still like me, but they don't. Okay, cool. I don't want them to like me anymore. Rhea, Boeotians. Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is really difficult. And I'm at war with all of Troy. Interesting. Interessante. Alright, enter. As Amelia would say. Oh, this is my last turn for the night, boys. I'm leaving soon. Oh boy, my back cracked. Actually, I should put some pants on. <laughs> pants. Sorry. Pants are a good idea. Yeah, I I have these super loose like um, what do you call them? Jeez, like these super loose pants which I have, but the, like it's nothing I can go out outside with. But it's like. I don't even know how to explain how comfortable they are. I don't care what you want to do, just go. Put 
Paris, I'm sure he's actually stronger than us. I need to go smack his face. But I'm, I'm really enjoying the light runners though. Like they have 66 speed and most units are around 30. So they run as twice as fast as units. So flanking with them is really easy. <laughs> and, uh, oh, what's this? Rhodes is taken up by someone else. We'll go deal with them. And I managed to get them always into the, in the field battle in the uh, archer lines. Because they don't okay, manage okay. to react in time, and they get 200 kills each, which, again, 200 kills, it's four units. Okay, you want military access? I'll give you military access. So, that amount of damage is incredible. Yeah, uh, there's your answer. The Dan host gathers, the Danian host gathers. Uh, it's obvious to the great Achaean kings that the Trojans refuse to listen to reason. All out war is inevitable at this point, so the major question is uh, concerns where you stand. You can decide later, declare no support. Uh, you hidden treasure from other Danians. You declare support for Danians from this point on. Factions marked as Danian players and opponents will never betray you. Answer this kind uh, or face their deadly retribution. Oh, this is really cool. Support. So, will you confederate with me now? <laughs> God damn it! Come to my side, we have Melton. It became harder. What? Oh, maybe the, the prayer went away? Yeah, the prayer went away. Where the hell is this guy's army? I think I'm gonna get ambushed by this guy, but eh. Eh. He just vanished. So that didn't work. Uh, but Jesus Christ, like a menmon. I declare war on someone and you just run to help. By taking the settlements I want. But it is not this day. This day I take what I want. And I finally have bronze. Woohoo! Woo uh, loot and occupy, because I don't give a crap about this region. Uh, oh, exceptional. Uh, warriors find the Opryus, uh Rumor has female creatures that restrain your reputation and business. Peter, they become former enemies. Allies, if you take your time to befriend them. Okay, what exists here? Oh, harpies. Oh, by the way, harpies are female um, skirmishers. Okay. okay. Which have the terrify ability? What do they have? They have, oh, they have flanking improved attack, so they do extra damage, and they're hidden all the time. Oh, that's really good, actually, and they have 63 missile damage. And their upgraded version, they have armor. Master ambushers. Flanking, stalks, oh, they can fire while hidden, strider. Jesus, these guys are good. And Vanguard deployment. Shoot while moving. I like. All right. Uh, repair and whatever. Uh, Mananes is coming in to help. Um, oh, he has a he has two armies. So you get up here and poison the well. Uh, archers get damaged or assassinates. Uh, Nine percent poison the well. Failure. No, he didn't do well. Okay, this is it guys for me today. I hope you enjoyed this one. I personally really liked it. I'm going to be playing this campaign a bit further. Um, tomorrow, hopefully tomorrow, I'll be able to publish a review for you guys. Um, I'm not sure if I'll manage because I've... Today it was a tough day in general, so I might just take the night off and uh, record something quickly tomorrow morning. Um, there's another video coming up tonight, uh, I'm doing basically, like yesterday, you're going to see all the units of 
uh, Melanaeus. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys had fun. And take care, guys. Bye bye. Bye. You managed to do it today. <laughs> yeah, it did.